If you've seen my previous video, I, I uh, showed you guys my updates on the blacked out emblems and this rear diffuser. Today I'm going to be showing you guys uh, the install and uh, my new part that I purchased uh, from getbmwparts.com. And this is the part. This is for a competition package X5. But I'm going to attempt to uh, put it on on my X5 M50i. Uh, I was a little skeptical of uh, buying this from that website because I never bought it from that website before. So I wasn't sure if it's a legit website or not. But after ordering it, it came it came uh, uh, pretty fast. So I just got it today. Uh, so this is the current one that comes with the vehicle. And this car uh, is equipped with extended shadow line trim, which gives you the blacked out grill. Uh, this blacked out um, air air vent. Uh, well, I guess they call it the air breather vent, and then you get um, this blacked out uh, shower line trim on the sides. So I'm going to show you guys how to install it. I actually did do the other side, and it did not fit well. Uh, there's a little bit of a gap, but uh, I'm going to put it on anyway. If it falls off, it falls off. I'll still have my old ones. Um, so what I have here to uh, remove remove it, I have this little kit I purchased from uh, Amazon. It's a trim removal kit. And I'm gonna apply some uh, frog tape just so I won't scratch any of the paint. I think I've seen only one YouTube video where someone is actually removing this this piece, the trim removal kit. It looks like it's it's pretty easy. I mean, the other side was easy, propped off really, but no problems. Um, so I'm just gonna work my way from the bottom and go on top. As you can see, it's already coming out pretty easily. There's just, I think there's just two clips holding on. And we got one clip off. Yep, there we go. Looks like one of the clips fell in here. There we go, we got it. So, there we go. So it looks like there's actually three clips. As you can see, one of them fell off. I don't think it broke off. I don't see any broken pieces, so um, I could reuse this again, I guess. So the new one, um, it's a little bit bigger and it doesn't ver fit very well, but I, I get, I'm able to latch on this top part and there's also tape. So I'll just take this part off. I'm going to take off the tape from the back. Uh, first, I'm going to try to line this front part first. As you can see, it doesn't, doesn't go in very well because it's bigger. I guess the, the X5 uh, the competition package The vents are probably bigger I get I'm assuming but there we go That's that's it Let me know in the comments below what you guys think does it match this car? Um, I tried to get this part from a local BMW dealer, but for some reason they couldn't even find the part. And I told them that it's from a competition, but they still didn't find it. Um, so here it is. And like I said, it didn't fit that well. As you can see, there's a little bit of a gap in the front part.
I may be able to remove in, maybe remove some of the clips on that side, and it might be able, to, it might fit better. That's the way it looks. Um, I did see uh, the same kind of air vent on Auto Technique, but they did not have this M emblem or the X5 uh, sticker. So I just decided just to buy it with one that has it. So again, um, I'll just do a quick um, sound check again. Uh, why not? I think it's the cold start. So you press a button three times and they'll turn it on for you. Press the button three more times and then they'll turn off. to get you guys a closer look. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching.